Uh, welcome back to another Zoom class. Uh, I will let you know what you need for equipment, uh, and then while you get that, we'll get things started. So for equipment, uh, pretty standard. We're going to need a mat because we're going to do some core work, some stuff on the ground, so something comfortable to lie down on. Uh, for weights, uh, anything from a 5 to 10-pound weight. Um, we'll be doing not a lot with them, but have them just in case. Uh, you want to add weights to some of the exercises we're going to be doing. Um, the exercises we provide for you are all done at your own risk. So, um, you know, make sure you're taking precautions. If you feel things aren't right, take your rest. Um, if at any time you feel like you need a break, absolutely take it. I will provide modifications for a number of the exercises. If even those modifications feel like they're a little a little too much uh, or uncomfortable, use that time to take a break or do a marching in place uh, as a substitute. Um, before we get started, I'd like to start off with a little positive focus. So um, again, saw a quote, really like the quote, um, and it goes, what you get by achieving your goals is not important as who you become by achieving your goals. So there's always a bigger picture to to pretty much everything we do, goal setting, goal achieving, um, you know, there's always that bigger picture and you always wanna look beyond the superficial. Um, so with that being said, we will get started. I'll show you the exercises and then we'll get right into the workout. All right, first exercise we're gonna do, you're gonna need those free weights. We're gonna do a squat to an overhead press. So you're going to come down, push up. If your shoulders are bothering you, you can just do a squat with a bicep curl. All right. Next, what we're going to do is a surrender lunge. So you're going to go down to one knee, down to two, up, up, down, down, up, up. Halfway through, I'll have you change the rotation so you can work both legs. Next, we're going to do a bent over row. So you're going to grab those weights again. You're going to hinge at the hips and you're gonna row with those dumbbells. All right, next what we're gonna do is a squat jack. So you're gonna get into that squat, hop up, feet to the middle, wide down load. Middle tall, wide low, just like that. Then we're gonna hit the ground and we're gonna do some spider planks. So you can do those high plank or low plank, and you're just gonna bring that knee out and up to the side. All right, next one we're going to do, we're going to roll right over into a bicycle. So right there, elbow to opposite knee. Then we're going to do a little wide leg sit up. So you're going to have your legs wide. You're going to come down, hands overhead, and you're going to sit up, right down the middle, come back down. Come up, down the middle, back down. Next we're going to do tires. So we're going to do sort of like that mock-up tire obstacle course. Go from one foot to the other, going forward, coming back. All right, and then we're gonna start right back up again. So those are the eight exercises. We're gonna do three rounds of those. And go ahead, pick up those weights. Starting off with that squat to overhead press in three, two, one, and go. Getting those weights right in the shoulders. Hips go back, push up, press those arms up. Down, up and press, up and press. Remember if your shoulders are bothering you or you have some issues, you can do a squat with a bicep curl. Squat, bicep curl. There we go, 10 seconds left. Good job, everybody, keep it going. Three, two, one, good job. Next one we're doing are those surrender lunges. So hands overhead and you're gonna go down to one, down to two, up, up. Keeping that chest nice and tall, making sure that front foot stays flat on the ground.
Well done. Three, two, one, change that rotation. Good job. So now we're going to be doing the other leg. Good work, everybody. Nice job. 10 seconds left. Three, two, one. Excellent job. Now we're doing those bent over rows. So you're hinging at the hips, pushing through that tailbone, keeping that chest open. And you're just going to pull those weights up, pinching those shoulder blades together. Nice job keeping that nice flat back in that neutral spine. Exhale as you bring that weight up, pinching those shoulder blades together. Nice job, everybody. Good work. Well done. 10 seconds left. Good work. Nicely done. Two, one. Excellent job. All right, next one we're going to be doing are going to be squat jacks. So we're going to start with our feet apart, down in that squat, and then we're hopping up, feet together, hopping back down. If the impact of the jump bothers your knees, you're going to do a step jack with a squat. All right? So that's the modification right there. You can still keep that pace to elevate that heart rate, or you're going down into that squat, hopping back up. Nice job, everybody. Good work. Keep that pace up. 10 seconds. Well done. Get that heart rate up. Two, one. Excellent job. Next, we're doing those spider planks. So remember, you can do those in a high plank where you're up here or challenge yourself a little bit more getting into that low plank. Knees come out and up to the side. Keeping those hips down in line with your shoulders. Squeezing that belly button to your spine. Making sure you keep that core activated. Nice job, everybody. Keeping those core strong. Nice work. 10 seconds left. Keep fighting. Push through. We go everybody nice job two one done nice job now we're just going to roll right over onto our backs and we're going to do those bicycles so you're going to try to do that double action where you're going knee to opposite elbow if you can't hold yourself up and it's farther in your back keep your back flat and go long and low with that pedal long and low but try to get that double action in there Nice job, working those abs, getting that burn in there. Nice job, everybody, keep it going. Ten seconds left. Three, two, one, done, nice job. All right next one we're gonna do with those wide leg sit-ups. Do you wanna get? those feet apart, you're going to lie back, and you're going to come up and do a sit and reach, come back down, nice and controlled with those movements, coming up, sit and reach, back down, up, using those abs to pull your upper body off the ground. Excellent work, everybody. Here we go. 
Coming up to the end now. Three, two, one. Excellent job. Round one done. Picking up those weights, going back to the beginning. So squats to overhead presses. So remember, push those but hips back. What about the tires? Oh, you're right. You just, yeah. Tires, tires. <laughs> Thank you. Doing those tires. So we're going here, here, here. Good job. Now remember, if that hopping bothers you, you're going to do a low impact version. But when you step to one side, you want to keep that leg up. So you're going to hold it for a second. Working that balance, working that core. So try to push yourselves. We're going to go back and forth. Nice job. And done. Now we're going back to the beginning. All right, grabbing those free weights. Loading them up. Squats to overhead press. Coming down, pushing up. Down, push up. Good job. Remember to keep those hips back. Feet stay flat. Chest nice and tall. The modification for your arms. Squat with a curl. Squat with a curl. Nice job. Exhale as you come up out of that squat and push that weight up overhead. Drive, drive, drive. Two, one. Excellent job. Surrender lunges. So hands up overhead, chest nice and tall. Come down, down, up, up. Can you give us some modification for knee problems, please? I'm sorry? A modification for people with knee problems. We can't do that. You can just do regular reverse lunges. Okay. Nice job, everybody. Keep it going. Next time through, we're going to do the other leg on round three. Three, two, one. Nice job. We're going to go with those bent over rows. So hinging at the hips, push through that tailbone, soft bend in your knees. And row. Exhale as you pull that weight up, pinching those shoulder blades together. Making sure you keep that neutral spine. So you want from your head all the way through your tailbone to be on that straight line. Nice job, everybody. Keep it going. Getting that row going, working those pull muscles so you're back in your biceps. Nice job. Three, two, one. Done. Nice job. Now we're doing those squat jacks. So start in that squat position. Popping up together and tall, wide and low. If you need that modification, step jack with the squat. Step jack with the squat. Nice job. Full squat jacks. Coming down, pushing up. Nice job, everybody getting that heart rate up, fighting through that fatigue. Nice job. Getting that sweat going. 10 seconds left. Three, two, one, uh, nice job. Now we're gonna go to the ground, those spider planks. You can go high or low with that plank. Low is a little bit more challenging. Bringing that knee out and up to the side. Now you can switch off. You wanna start high, 
We're stern low and finish high. Um, yeah, you're not dedicated to that one position. You can switch off customizing that workout, really challenging yourselves today. Nice work, everybody. 10 seconds left, keep pushing. Working those cores, keep those hips down in line with the shoulders. Three, two, one. Nice job. All right, now we're going to the bicycles. With your hands, make sure your fingers are just behind your ears. Don't lock your fingers behind your head. And you're gonna go elbow to opposite knee. Nice job. 30 seconds. The reason why we don't wanna lock our fingers behind our heads, we don't wanna tug on our neck, putting strain in our necks. So nice, light grip right behind the ears. Nice job, everybody, very good. Keeping those cores engaged, belly button to your spine, squeeze. Three, two, one. Excellent job, going to those wide leg sit-ups. So we're down, we're gonna come up, trying not to use that momentum, using our abs. Coming up, sit and reach, nice and controlled on the way down. Nice job, everybody. Nice tight cores. Exhale as you come up off the ground. Control that tempo. 10 seconds left. Tires coming up next. Three, two, one. Done. Nice job. Right, right up onto our feet. So remember, there's that modification where you're going to do alternating that foot but you want to pause. Keep that chest tall, keep that knee elevated, or you're going to be going that back and forth like you're in a tire course. Nice job. Get that knee up, toe up. Remember, you're going through a tire course. Don't want to trip your feet up. Nice job, everybody, looking good. 10 seconds left. Three, two, one. Excellent job, right back to the beginning. Last round. Rack those weights up. Going down to that squat. Up and press, down, up and press. Exhale as you come out of that squat. Nice job, everybody. Using this last round to empty those tanks. Last round, best round. Good work. 10 seconds left, fight through that burn. Three, two, one, excellent job. Weights down, surrender lunges are next. Modification for those are just alternating reverse lunges. So we're gonna do the other leg we didn't do last time. Down, down, up, up, down, down, up, up. Nice job, everybody. Coming down, pushing up off that foot. Try to limit the amount of sway you're gonna do. Really keep that core tight. Nice job, chest nice and tall. 
10 seconds left. Good work, everybody. Working those legs. Three, two, one. Excellent job. Grabbing those weights again. Bent over rows, hinging at the hips. Soft bend in those knees. And exhale as you pull those weights up. There we go, everybody. Work in those pull muscles. Keep that posture nice and straight in the back. Exhale on the way up. Keep that core tight. Nicely done, everybody. Looking good. 15 seconds left. Well done. Three, two, one. Excellent work. Squat jacks are next, or those step jacks with the squat. And go ahead, begin when you are ready. Nice job, everybody. Getting those heart rates elevated, working those legs, staying nice and tall with your posture. Keep your eyes forward. Your chest tends to follow your eyes. So if your eyes are down, your chest will go down and you'll put it in your back. Keep those eyes up. Work those legs. Nice job. 10 seconds left. Keep fighting. Keep pushing. Two, one. Excellent job, spider planks. So finish up on the ground. Here we go. You can go high or low. And go. Remember to keep those hips in line with your shoulders. You want to keep them low. Keep that belly button tucked in. Squeeze and breathe. Squeeze and breathe. Nicely done, everybody. Not letting that fatigue beat us. Keep pushing. 10 seconds left. Well done, everybody. Good job. Three, two, one. Excellent job. And we're rolling over into those bicycles. So remember, keep those fingers right behind the ears. Going elbow to opposite knee. Nice job. If you're feeling it in your back, let those shoulders drop and just do long and low with those legs. Really working it. Keeping that core strong. Well done, everybody. Squeeze and breathe. Three, two, one. Excellent job. Wide leg sit-ups. Now try not to use the momentum. You really want to isolate those abdominal muscles. Coming down nice and controlled. Come up. Squeeze. Pull yourself up with those abs. Exhale as you're coming up. Sit and reach. Nice job, everybody. Good work. Almost done. We've got 10 seconds left in this exercise. Tires coming up next. Three, two, one. Excellent job. Back up onto our feet, finishing strong here with tires. And going forward. 
backwards. Keeping that knee up high, toe up high. Stay nice and tall in that posture. Back and forth. Nice job, everybody. Looking good. Here we go. 15 seconds left. Empty those tanks. Do that modification. Knee up, toe up, hold. Knee up, toe up, hold. Keeping that posture nice and tall. And done. Nicely done today, everybody. Well done. Congratulations. Another successful workout completed. All right, so uh, before we leave, I'm going to leave with a little bit of some nutritional tips. Um, liven up your salads. It's the summer. Salads are everywhere. Salads are great. Um, but instead of just using leafy greens and like carrots, uh, try using a mix of greens. Put in some kale, some spinach, arugula, uh, radicchio, mustard greens. Really liven up that salad. Add something like almonds, chickpeas, goat cheese, and then oil and vinegar makes a great dressing. So that's a really good way to kind of change up a regular boring salad, give it some flavor, give it some added nutrients. Um, so that's my nutrition advice for you. Thank you for the workout and uh, have a great rest of your week and I'll see you later. Great. Bye, everybody. Thank you.